Local 10. There's some drone video after a deadly crash in Northeast Miami-Dade. A 52-year-old driver was killed in the wreck over the weekend. Local 10 News reporter Parker Branson joins us live. And he tells us about the UM football player who was actually injured in this crash. How is that player doing? Christy, good afternoon. I can tell you that player is going to be okay. That player is a highly recruited South Florida native who now plays for the University of Miami. And new today, we are getting the first look at the aftermath of that crash. Sources say University of Miami freshman football player and Miami Central High alum Wesley Besaint was injured in a crash that left one person dead. Drone video showing the aftermath Friday evening in Northeast Miami Dade. Police say 52 year old Saul Dolphin died in the crash. This happening at the intersection of Ives Dairy Road in Northeast Third Court. A makeshift memorial growing at the crash site. Flower, candle, and balloons left behind so far. Now, we spoke with a woman who lives nearby. She says the roads were closed for hours as police investigated. I didn't see the accident itself, but um, as I was walking back to my home, I did see the car that was crushed up against the wall. Police say 18 year old Zaylin Reese, a Miami Central High football player committed to play at Valdosta State, was behind the wheel of a Mercedes driving on Ives Dairy Road. When Dauphin turned left in the path of Reese's Mercedes, leading to the collision. According to Miami Dade Police, the other passengers involved in the crash were 17 to 18 years old and only had minor injuries. Sources say the Saint's ankle was banged up, but he's expected to be okay and ready to practice in the summer. Miami Dade Police say traffic homicide detectives are still looking into what exactly caused this crash. We're live in Northeast Miami Dade. I'm Parker Branton, Local 10 News.